Hey guys, while I'm behind the scenes getting everything ready for your viewing pleasure of the upcoming project, here are some things that you can do. Number one, if you are not already following me on Facebook or YouTube or Instagram, be sure that you go ahead and you like my fan page on Facebook, that you follow my page on YouTube, and that you follow me on Instagram. And make sure your notifications are turned on on all of those sites. So that way you never miss an announcement that I have have to make about products that could be coming out or when I'm getting ready to go live or if there's specials that I'll have going on where you'll want to go into my VIP group. Which brings me to that. My VIP group link is right down below in the description of the video on both YouTube and Facebook. If you're not already in there, I would love it if you would go ahead and join my VIP group. It's a great place to be, you guys. Next thing I want to talk to you about is Club Couture. If you haven't already heard, Club Couture is the hottest DIY home subscription service out there, bringing DIY creativity to your door every single month. It's only $19.99 plus tax in the US and $26.99 plus tax in Canada. And guess what? It's going to ship free to you every single month. What will ship free to you? Well, an exclusive size B transfer that only Chalk Couture designers and Club Couture customers can receive once they become a Club Couture customer and three coordinating Chalk Pace singles. Don't worry about seeing the Club Couture transfer right now in this part of the video because I'll be showing you once we start the live. You will also gain access to my private Club Couture VIP group, where I go and create three additional projects every single month without fail to give you the most bang for your buck with that Club Couture transfer. You'll also get bonus flat rate shipping. I'll go over that as well once we go into the project. But just know you're going to get bonus flat rate shipping of $4.95 in the US and $9.95 in Canada. It's pretty awesome. You will also get access to exclusive offers and deals directly from Chalk Couture each month for being one of my Club Couture customers. Now, we're going to go ahead and we're going to be talking about the opportunity to go ahead and purchase your business in a box, launch your empire, and join my award-winning team. Stay tuned for that. So, hope you're ready for the project that's about to come. Thanks for watching, guys, and thanks for joining me today. Hey, hey, friends. Happy Sunday. Let's do the important stuff so we can get into the fun stuff because boy, do I have a fun project planned for today. So as I said in this short video before, the Club Couture transfer this month is the Go Confidently transfer. It's so amazing, you guys. You can't beat $19.99 US, $26.99 Canadian for a awesome DIY home subscription service. It truly is the best one. So not only do you get an exclusive transfer every month that only Club Couture customers and designers can get, you will also get the bonus flat rate shipping of $4.95 US, $9.95 in Canada. You will get access into my exclusive Club Couture VIP group where I make three additional projects every single month without fail to give you the most bang for your buck. You'll also get exclusive offers and deals directly from Chalk Couture for being one of my Club Couture customers. And this month's um, club promo is pretty great. 15% off our Chalk It Up kits. We will have another kit become available next week. So that'll be three kits that you can choose from. Hopefully the fourth one will be able to make it in by the end of next week. The other amazing thing you will get when you join this month is you're gonna get that awesome spring summer catalog um, that just launched on February the 2nd for free, which is super awesome. You don't wanna miss out on that. And when you become a club kit member this month, you've gotta do it before the end of the month, you guys, and your payment comes out for May, uh, March the 5th, you will get a creamy, dreamy paste pack which will include two brand new creamy dreamy chalk paste singles and an exclusive transfer. We don't even know what it is, you guys. It's a size A transfer and it's gonna be amazing. So if you are ready to join Club Couture, please do it ASAP. Um, remember, I've been challenged to hit 20 Club Couture customers this month. I am up to eight. I still need 12 more and I can't do it without your help. Click that link in the description of the video on both YouTube and Facebook. Now, let's talk about my favorite thing in the whole wide world, and that is the ability to purchase your business in a box, launch your empire, and join my award-winning team. This is our new designer kit, aka Business in a Box. I call it a business in a box because everything you need to jumpstart your empire can be found in that box. It is a small investment of $99 plus tax and shipping in the U.S., $127 plus tax and shipping in Canada, and you guys, it's going to ship to you with a value at valued at 240 US, 330 Canadian, and it's going to include 
Five three ounce chalk paste, a small squeegee, an apron, a 12 pack of thank you cards, a 12 pack of chalkable chips, a board and base, a nine by 12 porcelain steel Ada magnetic chalkboard, the Read Me, that gorgeous spring summer 2021 catalog, six silk screen adhesive back reusable transfers from that catalog, and that exclusive Club Couture transfer. Now, I know I realized um, that I threw out a whole lot of info at you and you're probably saying, Jess, girl, that's a lot and I still have questions. Please don't worry. I have your answers. All you need to do is click the link to my opportunity group, which can be found in both uh, the description on YouTube and Facebook and request to join it. Once I see your request, I'll go ahead and approve you and tag you in a video that I did that will go ahead and answer all the questions you need to know in order to make an educated decision about not just joining Chalkature, you guys, but joining my team. I want it to be a decision you're happy with. So here's a little something up on my screen for all of my brand new friends who are just joining um, in case you are unaware of what Chalk Couture is while I get some stuff done on my end. Um, let's see who we've got here. Hi, Debbie Frith. Hi, Mary Beth. Hey, Kristen Dang. Hi, Tracy. Hey, Deb Martin Burns. How you been, girl? Hi, Mary Egger. Hi, Carla Ann. Hi, Amy Grossman. Hey, Patty Phelan. Hi, Mary Egger. Thank you for sprinkling. Hi, Burn. Hi, Carolyn Bonner. Thank you for sprinkling, Deb. See you guys. I'm so excited. I have some good things to share. We're going to make a super fun project today. And I finally got my Envo colors from the launch. They finally showed up. Um, thanks to the crazy weather. It's got a little delayed, but that's okay. We have it. And I'm going to share with you. I found the best drink ever <laughs> on TikTok. Okay. I am currently drinking it now. I have a full cup of it. So hopefully, hmm, hopefully it doesn't affect my judgment. <laughs> But I will share it with you as we're going along. Hi, Vicki Keller. Hey, Teresa Long. Hi, Lisa LeBlanc. Oh, you're so cute. Thank you so much. Hey, Melissa Southern. So let's go ahead and let's share a little about... We got a big mess, it looks like, on my desk. But we're going to be using it all today. Let me show you first the things that came in from my launch, our Phase 2 launch. Here's our brand new handled squeegee, you guys. I love this handled squeegee. This part feels like our actual squeegees now. It's not that hard rubber that didn't want to budge. And it's got a really nice silicone grip. And of course, it matches our signature couture teal. So that's the first thing that came. And then you guys already saw these awesome colors, our Shimmer Melon and Shimmer Splash, our two on Vogue new shimmer colors that we got. And then finally, I got the other three colors. We've got Golden Arrow, Tulip, and Pistachio. I am obsessed with these colors. These scream spring and even summer to me, you guys. So super excited to finally have my on Vogue colors in. So hooray! Oh, that's my shimmer splash. I don't think we're going to use that right now. Okay, so we've got a really fun project scheduled. Oh, wait, you guys, I don't think I showed you this either. Hold on. This is the Bloom chalk paste single pack, which I plan to use the colors from this today. Did I already? Oh yeah, I did have this. I do have this. The Meadow Daffodil Peony Dune Raspberry Sorbet and Sage. That's our the colors that come in it. And guys, you can feel that it is creamy, dreamy goodness because we changed the foil of our chalk paste singles um, to be better in shipping and transit because they pretty much burst. They used to burst all the time. So we are going to not have to worry about that anymore, you guys. So that's super exciting. And like I said, you can feel that the chalk paste is creamy, dreamy. Okay, so let's talk about what we're going to do today. So we're going to be using some things from the Dollar Tree. We're going to be using some things from the dollar uh, from the bullseye, okay? And then we're going to be using some fun pom-pom ribbon from... Joann's. Okay. So I got some fun colors. I'm not sure which one I'm going to use yet. I kind of, I don't know. I think we're going to play it by ear based off of the colors that I use, but I'm pretty excited that I got some of this now. So that's fun. Um, did I say golden arrow? Oh, golden hour, Kim Frazier, golden hour. So, um, there is that. Let's see. We should check to see if you posted today. Got, got up and boom, here I am. Hi, Kathy Toms. Can I see your bunny from the other day? The, oh, this one, Kristen, this, the one that I made yesterday, my, my bunny door hanger. Here he is, his little cottontails under the sign here. 
with Happy Easter. Love it, love it, love it. I love how it turned out. I can't wait to put it up on my door. Okay, so let's talk about what we're going to be doing today, you guys. Now, part of this is going to be inspired by my sweet friend, Heidi. So if Heidi is on, she is who inspired me to create this. So what we're going to do is I'm using two St. Patty's Day signs from the Dollar Tree because, well, you guys, I didn't go out and get any wood, okay? So I'm just going to lift these pieces up because I don't need anything to help me with making it bumpier than what it already is, okay? They may already have Easter ones, but when I went, they only had the St. Patty's ones. So there we go. Okay, so now it's not going to be bumpy when I put it down and I can lay it flat. So we're going to be painting these and using some of our big popsicle sticks to hold them together, okay? Um, we're going to paint this side, and actually I'm going to see if I can take this out of the hole for now. Will it allow me to pull it out? Yeah, it will. Great. And we'll put it back in when we're done, okay? Let's see. Pull you out. Hold on. I need something to like hammer it out because it's tight. Well, that's not going to work. Ugh. Probably going to break that up. Oh, oh, I didn't. Yeah, he came out. Okay, so there's that one. Let's see. Oh, you're so welcome, Kristen. Happy to assist. Happy to assist. Cutest little bunny ever. Oh, thanks, Carolyn. Got my... Dollar carrots from Bullseye today, too. Pick up a bunch of those tiny dollar houses while you're there. Just need the short, tall jars. Oh, yes. I got all of them. I did find the, of course, Kristen, guess what was in my dollar spot? The little house and the egg and the arrow thing, of course. Okay. So, first thing we're going to do, uh, actually, I got to wait for my hot glue gun to heat up. So, you know what we'll do first? We'll go ahead and get these painted. Now, I'm going to paint them, and I am going to be adhering it together with some hot glue and some popsicle sticks, like I said, to sort of um, hold it together. Once we paint it and it's dry, I'm going to use a pattern transfer. Of course, you guys know I'm in love with that. Uh, what is it called? The country plaid? I can't, I'm drawing a blank on the name of it. Um, country plaid. Yeah. We're going to be using the country plaid to do the background. And then we're going to make a little hanging banner with the cute little bunnies to hang down. And we'll put our cute little baskets here. I'm probably going to cut this a little bit with a razor blade, these, these little plank things. And inside we'll put some eggs. We'll put some carrots. I think it's going to turn out super cute. I actually might enlist brands help to help me cut it with the, uh, the, to make a straight edge. So there is that. Now let's go back to the comments. I can see them. Um, there's that. Okay. So let's paint this. All right. Let me get my paint here. So I'm going to be using my, you guys know me, my favorite paint. I'm going to be using some weathered white sea paints. Apparently I didn't open this one yet, or this might be the one I got for my house. Okay. And I'm going to use, I'm going to take a sip. Mm. So good, you guys. Have you guys heard of Pink Whitney Vodka from New Amsterdam? Oh, my God. Pink Whitney Vodka, Lemonade, and Sprite. Drink of champions. <laughs> I'm enjoying a, an adult beverage with Bran today. He's hanging out down here, so make sure you guys say hi to Bran. Bran, you want to say hi to everybody? Hi, everyone. He says hi, everyone. So we're just hanging out. I got... Four out of nine videos completed this morning for while I'm away in Hawaii. So you guys will have a project every day I'm gone. I got to get them. I'll finish them up tomorrow and get them scheduled for, um, well, I'll get them scheduled probably Tuesday. So that way they're all ready to rock and roll. Get them all done. Uh, she does, Kristen. She really does. Hi, Heidi. How are you? Yeah, hopefully, I wonder if I, my Heidi Bostic will jump on. She's just so creative. And I got the little pennant banner idea from her. Not this part. Little pennant banner. Okay. Okay. 
I'm going to paint this all the way down until I decide where I'm ready to stop. So I might as well just paint the whole thing just to be safe all the way down. You guys may not see me painting this bottom part, but I promise you that's what I'm doing. Little of this paint goes a real long way. And I love that I can clean it up with just a wet wipe. Just cleans up so nicely. So I don't mind that I get it on my tabletop because it'll come off. Okay, we got one done. Let's get the other one done. And I'm not bothering with the back side. I don't really care what that looks like, to be honest with you. So how's everybody's Sunday? Did you guys have a good day? I hope you did. A chocolate martini. Yummy, Kathy. Let's see. Hi, Kim. Can you please show me the chalk paste jars would fit in the wooden boxes? I'm thinking of ordering some to make a rack to hold my paste. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Where's the jars of paste I just had? Oh, here we go. Yeah, I think you can fit two in. Um, oh, you can fit them on top of each other, too. So you could definitely do two next to each other and do two on the top. Look. For sure you can. There you go. Four fit in them. Four of them. There you go. Yeah, I just bought a, a rack from uh, Hobby Lobby. And I just have it mounted on my, my wall. Okay, look at this. This paint's already drying, you guys. It's like so good. So, so good. Big Bran and I had such a nice morning. We really did. Little Bran stayed at my parents' house last night. He was helping them with some things, and Big Brand and I just, he went to a show last night, not like a concert or anything, just a like a very local show, and I stayed home and watched old comedy movies. I watched Blended and 21 Jump Street and laughed the entire time, did not even realize he was gone. It was great. I was going to come down and craft a little, and then I started hearing noises, and I was like, nope! Nope, nope, nope. I'm out. So I stayed upstairs and watched movies instead until he came home. Okay. There we go. We are all covered. So we'll let this dry real quick. Let me close up my paint. I'm wondering if I want to paint the box. I don't think I want to paint my boxes the white. It's only 2 p.m. here. Is ending. Uh, Kim Frazier, it most definitely is. It's a Sunday. Kristen, you're getting more snow. Oh, my gosh. Um, what about long ways? Long ways. Oh, I think you'll probably only be able to stack three long ways. Yeah, you'll only be able to stack three long ways. Why did I put... I'm glad you asked me to do that. That was my open one. Okay, open. This is closed. That's got to go over there. Hold on. Now I messed up my paste. <laughs> I think this was the other closed one. Yes. Okay, good. These two I don't need. Husband. What? Yeah, you know what I'm going to say to you. Why? Nothing. Nothing, nothing. Um, oh yeah, I'm saying stuff to you, to you, Mr. 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 Nice. Windows and doors open, Kathy. Light. Nice. Oh, you're welcome, Karen. Hey, Court. I know. I feel like I do, Kristen. Hey, Jane. I just started, girl. You didn't miss much of anything. Okay. Oof. You're such a loser. <laughs> You are such a dork, man. Okay, you know what? I'm going to use Mermaid Mist. Mermaid Mint. 
for my boxes. All right, let's dry these so I can put them on top of each other. <clears throat> Just quick dry in this stuff, you guys. Hey, Lisa Batten. My daughter has gone to a few concerts this past year. They're set up like a drive-in movies. Can sit in your car or on top. Oh, wow, Kathy. That's crazy. There is none around here. Ah, hey, Cheryl Shepard. She says, hi, Bran. Mine is three in Texas today. Oh, last week, Deb Burns. Yes. Yes, I know. You guys have not had it easy in Texas. And today it's 67. Oh my gosh, you guys already got hit with so much, and now you'll get hit with flooding from all the snow melting. Kristen, you'll have to message me a picture of it. I don't know what you're talking about. I didn't see. Okay. Okie dokie. So this, whoops, hold on. I see a spot I did not dry. Right there. All right. So we are, oops, right there. It's not dry either. We are pretty much dry. Dry enough that I can at least lift this up and put it on top of each other. Okay. And we'll put it to the side. Let me get this tabletop cleaned off real quick. Really quickly. Fern says, hey, Bran, make me a cocktail. <laughs> send it right over. He said, I'll send it right over, Burn. You got up to 47, Tracy. That's awesome. Yeah, considering it was nine last night, that is pretty good. It's like a heat wave. Oh, thanks, Annie. Okay. We're going to move on. This, this project, you guys always say you like my longer projects. This is going to be a longer project. I can promise you that. There's multiple steps involved in it. See how easy the paint comes off? This is why I like this paint. Cleans up so nicely. Okay. And we are clean. All right. So let's do, whoops, let's try this. So let's paint our cute little boxes next. Okay. Let me get the stickers off the bottoms really quickly. One. Whoops. Okay. Two. Now these are just little bucket thingies, I guess. That's the only way I can describe it that I got from the Dollar Tree. So we're going to get, um, going to get a paintbrush. Hey babe, do you mind to wash this paintbrush for me so it doesn't dry out? It's right here. Okay. I'll put it, it's going to be in the front of my desk. Okay. All right. Oh, this color is so pretty. I think it's going to go nicely. What we're going to do, stop for a drink. Oh, I'm glad you guys like the long projects. Thanks, Chris. All right, so let's just go ahead and get these painted real quick. I want this to feel bright and cheery. And like... bright cheery spring like because what I'd ultimately like to be able to do is change the pennant banners out um, for the summer because even this color could be used for summer for like ocean themed things um, I would use this for like spring summer Easter for sure okay this color is perfect for it
feel like I just got totally silent because I was concentrating really hard to not touch. Thanks, babe. Just You can just rinse it real good and bring it back to me and I'll wrap it up. Thank you. You're the bestest. He knows. He knows. He knows. Just getting inside the handle spot. All right, I'm going to leave that like that. I'll dry it, and then I'll come in and do the opposite side. Okay. Sure, I could have probably prepped this before this live, but what fun is that? I get more time to talk to you guys. More time and more fun. Right? Right, 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 right. Thanks, babe. Mm -hmm. You can just put it right back where you got it from. Gosh, I love this color. It's so pretty. It, Annie Giuliano, it is called Mermaid Mist. Yes, Kim, here you go. I'll send you the link right now. They're my favorite. I have, like I said, I have no affiliation with them. I just, I just love their paint. I just love it. Um... Here you go, Kim. Yep, it's called Mermaid Mist. Nice, Kathy. Whoopsie. Yeah, I, I definitely could have done that, Vicky. I just figured since he was right there, I'd ask him just to rinse it for me. I just got to bind it up in my paper towel now. As soon as I'm done painting this side, I'll do that really quickly. I always like to get the color off the lid because I don't want to waste any of it. There it goes. Okay. Let me get this wrapped up really quickly. I totally reuse the same paper towels over and over that I wrap up my... Um, paint brushes with. Why replace paper towels? I just keep them in a little bin, right? Hello, we're in a pandemic. We can't be wasting paper towels. Can't be wasting them. Okay, there's that. Okay, let's try this so I can get the opposite side. I hope so, Kristen. That would be awesome. If not, I'm gonna have to call Kyle and tell her to be on the lookout for packages at my house. Sandy Strainer, how you been, girl? You're so welcome, Jean. You are welcome, Kimber. Oh, yeah, my watch band. It really is. You're right. It's close. Really close to the color. Okay, this is dried enough that I can put it on its side. Hi, Jeanette. How are you? Sandy, how you been, girl? Okay. 
quick get this side painted. And then these guys we could put to the side to finish drying more full. sure to get into the crack here on this side and we'll make this be the front okay just got to finish the little circle here a little loop get this painted okay I guess I don't think I'm gonna do the inside because I plan on having it filled so I'm not gonna do the inside but I will do the edge There we go. So that part is done. Let's get this part all done. Okay, paint the front here. And then this part will be painted. This be the front side. Okay. All right, so we are all painted with this, with these guys. Can I have you wash one more for me when you have a second, babe? Thank you. Whenever you get time. Okay, let's dry them. They will be turning on the other three add-on kits on Tuesday. Kim, I know uh, there are two of them are already available. The third one will be Tuesday. The fourth one we're hoping to get next week, the ink one. We don't have the pillow covers. Okay. I'm just going to get the top of this one dry. Oops, I see a spot I missed. Hold on. Around the handle. Missed that part. Okay. Good thing I still had some on there. Okay. These guys can go to the side. So that way, that one, yep. Thanks, babe. That way... They can finish drying while I work on part three of this. There we go. Yikes, I've got it all over my hands. The new tree transfer? Oh, I don't know when it's coming out. No, Kristen. I just know that they pulled that one because it didn't meet QC standards. So it's on reorder. Wow, that's weird. Kathy, that's really weird. Okay. Okay. Just getting this all finished. Okay. Here we go. Okay, hands are clean enough. They will work now. So, now we're going to move on to the pennants. And with the pennants, we are going to be doing... Thanks, babe. Mm -hmm. Appreciate it. Here go. Wrap this guy up. Okay, what did I do with them? Okay, so we're going to do three 5 by 7 pennant banners. Thanks, Mary. Okay. So, we've got one. We've got two. 
what I do with the other? Oh. We've got three. Now, I wish I had my iron here, but I do not. It is at the store. Probably should bring it home from there. Considering, I don't know when I've chalked at the store last now. It's been a long time. It's been a very long time, you guys. Hi, Gothic Fairy. How are you? Okay. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use probably one of our ink mats to hold these down. And we're going to get our cute little bunny duo transfer. Okay. Let's get that. Let me get out the transfer. Is. You guys, I cannot wait for the coordinating cutouts to be available on Tuesday, along with our vintage truck and the simple shapes and the decorative cutting boards. Oh, I just need all of them in my life. Hi, Helene. How are you? Hi, Mary Carol. How are you? Okay, so we've got that. Now let's get our transfer trimmers. And I think I'm going to do, hmm, I don't know. Huh. Hi. How are you doing, handsome? Just waiting to... Go back and forth on Messenger with the guy. Good. I'll help you. Don't worry. Hubby's got to ship stuff out. And I'm like, oh, I can help you with that. I can help you with that. <laughs> Just once or twice, right? Um, oh, you can hop in the shower. Um, I was going to ask for your help with cutting these down, but maybe I'll just leave them the full size instead. I think that's what I'll do. I'll take this beer to the shower. Okay, you do that. How did you think? Oh, okay. You're so silly. Okay. Oh, Mary Carol, it always gets worse before it gets better, girl. It truly does. I've been there, done that. Brand will tell you, when I am cleaning and organizing something, I make it 10 times worse than what the mess already is. And then I make it come together better. I promise. It, it will it will happen. But it and it'll be it'll it'll be worth it. Right? Good on your website, BMB Computer. Looking at chalk paste, I get paid Friday, so my paycheck. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Gothic Fairy, what is your real name? I can only see your YouTube name, and I feel bad calling you that. I know it's your username, but I, feel, I would like to be able to call you by your name. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is two little squatting bunnies and one of the stand-up bunny. And I am not going to put faces, I don't think, on them. I'm going to do them in multiple colors to make them feel very spring-esque, if you will. Oh my gosh, my poor thing has zero stick left. Where is my pixie spray? We're going to test this out. I have a full container of this at the store. I need to switch it out for the half you for the three quarter used one here. Okay. There we go. Much better. Much, much better. Okay. We can do one at a time. Right? Let's get our cute little bun bun on the first one. Oh, he's going to be so cute. Oh, you guys. Little bunny. Little Bun Bun. Oh, we love them. Okay. We got 
that one on. Let's get this guy on. I think we can make him fit. He's a little too high. Let's take him down a little bit. He was a little too high up. Okay, he is so cute. Okay, so let's get our bunnies going. Now, in the, I forget which pack. Is it Bloom? Let me see. No, I think it's Vacay. In the Vacay Pace Single, we're gonna because we're going to use a mix of colors from both of them. So in the Vacay Pace Single, they have Couture Teal, Couture Coral, and Bumblebee. I believe those are the colors I want to use. So Couture Teal, Couture Coral, and Bumblebee for our sweet little bunnies. Or should, yeah, you know what? We'll do Couture Teal because it's, it's like a blue. So let's think. Should we do... Let's do Couture cor uh, Coral, Couture Teal, and we'll do bum another Bumblebee in on, on that size. Okay, this is going to be perfect. So let's see. I lost my comments. Here it goes. Not Abigail, just Abby. Okay, awesome, Abby. Gothic, Gothic Fairy Abby. I can remember that. It is nice to meet you. Um, those cutting boards and the vintage truck cutouts are going to be so, oh, Kathy Tom, say that again. For sure. For sure. My washer sounds like it's going to take all by itself over the list until he get a new one and the washer's only five and eight years old and new washer's going to, oh no, Kristen, that's rough, girl. That is way rough. All right, let's do our cute little bunnies. Ruh row. We may have had a bleed on this guy because... I think I put it over the crease. That's okay. If it happens, it happens. It's not a big deal. We're going to distress it anyway. You guys know how I love to distress. Right? Don't you bleed, bunny. Don't you even think about it. Okay. So there is that. Let's take him off. Oh, my precious little bun bun. Look at him. He's so cute. <gasps> I love it. Okay, so we got one bunny down. Let's move him off to the side so I don't accidentally mess him up. So we got one little bunny down. Let's get this closed up. My color tray. Okay, couture coral. Oh, Kristen, I'm sorry, girl. I'm still the dead of winter here, and I'm... Working on Halloween projects. Abby, you are too funny. Girl, If you, whatever floats your boat, right? There is no right or wrong way to craft. If that's what you enjoy, you do you, girl. Americana is my favorite thing ever to craft. I am like, I want to just hurry up and get through Easter, St. Patty's Day, Spring, so we can get to my Americana stuff. That is like my favorite stuff ever. Ever, ever, ever. I'm trying to be super careful right here because there is the registration mark. And I don't want to put the registration mark onto this. Um, uh, what is it called? Pennant. Okay, I tried to get all of it off because what my hope would be to be able to, would be to be able to pick up and move. Oh, I had a little bleed. Oh, bun bun. I'm sorry. So sorry. I had a little bleed, but it's okay. I don't really care. It's fine. Oh, he's perfect. Other than my little bleed area, he's perfect. A little bleed in the ears. Not a big deal. Not the end of the world. Okay, got that one done. Now let's come on and let's make another one out of the bumblebee. 
and then we'll have a good start on the pennant banners. I'm going to see what happens if I put the pennant banner, if I put this down and use the bumblebee over it. We're going to see what happens. We're going to go with it right here. We're going to just see. Hopefully it doesn't pick up too much of the color. Okay. The bumblebee needs a little help. A little bit of distilled water. And a stir stick. Where are you? distilled water took them right took it right back to being great sometimes it happens and this isn't even a creamy dreamy color yet just wait until we get that okay let's see what happens this color might morph a little because of the coral but we're gonna see we are gonna see why can I not squeeze any color there? It may turn a bit orange. We'll see what happens. Oh, darn it, I did the registration mark. Whoops-a-daisy. Let's see if we can... <laughs> Let's see if I can get some distilled water on there and take it off. Yeah, I'd rather have a little bit of a stain than the... the, the oh! A lot of a stain. Darn it. Okay, hold on. Isn't this, that is Bumblebee. Okay. Not bad. You don't really see it all that much. Okay, so that is done. Now, um, let's put this over here. Let's get these closed up because I don't think we need these colors anymore. I think we're good. Okay. I like the bunnies without the faces too. Kim, or Kristen rather, you've already read my mind, girly. I'm going to be putting a little cottontail on them and I think I'm going to do it, but I want to do a multicolored pom-pom tail. Um, I have, well... I guess we don't have to actually do that. We can do little pom-pom tails from this. They'll be sparkly at least. So I'm just going to take them off this. Mm. One, the only problem is I'm going to have to do a different one for the big bunny because his tail is way too big. So I'm going to get off this. Remember I used this the other night, you guys? Oh, all right. Just, this is perfect. There we go. He just doesn't get a fun... He doesn't get a shiny tail. And that's okay. He'll be all right. He'll be fine. Okay, so we've got this one, and we've got these one, and we've got these one. And I wonder... You know what? I really don't even mind that he's got a little bleed. It's a okay his, these little tails are going to be a little too tiny. Dang it. But you know what? It's okay. It'll be just fine. They'll be so cute. Okay, so we've got that. Now what I want to do is I want to come back to my pom-pom ribbon, my other colors that I got. And I did have a teal that was supposed to be coming. Don't know where it is. I guess maybe, I don't know. I don't know where it went. 
So I've got this one, which I think actually might be super cute and super perfect for it, or this one. This one's actually more bright and cheery. But this one is more pastel -y. Okay, you guys tell me which one you like best. You tell me. Which is better for this? This one? Here, I'll spread it out. That way you can see. Or do we want to just do regular old pink? You guys let me know. Right? I agree, Heidi. Right. I told you that was a great movie, Kathy. Hi, Dion. Thanks. The pastels. Brandy says pastels. Lisa says pastels. That drink is so good. The pastels with right ribbon, says Stephanie. Hi, Aileen. She says pink. Kim says pastels with the white ribbon. Okay, so it seems like we're getting a ton. All right, everybody, even Harveta. Am I saying your name right, Harveta? Okay, so that's the one we're going to go with. So we'll just move these to the side. So what I want to do is I'm going to do a little bit. How the heck? Okay, I'm going to put it right across the top for all of these, okay? Whoops, the daisy. So all I'm gonna do is just hot glue it on. So let me figure out my spacing here. Oh, I'm coloring everything yellow. Okay, so we've got that one. Oh, these are perfect. Perfect spacing, you guys. Uh-oh, I split this one, but I can get it back together with hot glue. I'm not worried. And then we've got... This is all twisted up. All twisted up. Come on. I'm trying to touch this the least as possible. There we go. Okay. So we'll put that, uh, that to the side. All right, let's go ahead and let's get our little pom-pom booties glued on. You guys, they're so cute. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh. You guys are all on the same page. I love it. And I love when you guys interact with me. I love that. All right, let's do one at a time here. So let's put these guys out of the way. All right. So we're actually going to turn him around. Okay. There we go. Ow, I'm burning my finger here. Ah. Oh, I just stuck my finger all in it, so it's fine now. It'll work. <sighs> oh my gosh, that hurt. Get out. Okay, there we go. So we got the one. And I'm going to have to re-glue it down in some spots because it did not take. We got this little bunny done. Okay. Um, Melanie, I got it from Joanne's. 
How about an earring? That's too funny. Aren't the tails so cute? So, so cute. Okay. Now I think what's going to be easiest this time is if I just lay the glue down. And just start there. Hmm. Oh my gosh, it's so precious. Look. Okay, let's get our third one. <gasps> Delish, don't do it. Okay, do it again. We'll start in the corner here. Okay, and I'll just get this started. Huh, you are hot. Okay. I think I'm going to watch the invisible guest next oh i seen a, i feel like i saw a preview on that we started to watch something last night and i can't remember what it was and we, were, we just couldn't get into it and some of them i know like you've got to get through like the first couple of episodes for it to really be good like i know that's the way it was with us for Shit's creek um we had a hard time getting into it but by the third episode we were hooked Okay, there are the starter of our little pennants. Okay, now we've got to come on back. Let's put these out of the way. Um, let's see. Uh, do, 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 do. Okay. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn these over. And I am going to use, whoops, hold on. Can't reach them. Ugh. I'm going to get my popsicle sticks. I do too, Mary. Thank you, Stacy, in my VIP group. Oh, yeah, I just ordered it online and did pick up curbside pickup. You have to order a minimum of two yards for it, I believe. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do I am going to glue the sticks all across okay gosh they're hot hopefully I have this lined up right and I am gonna just do multiple sticks to try to hold it all together Right, Kim Weiner? Oh my gosh, I know. Harvetta, I got these from the Dollar Tree. And I just painted the opposite side all white. That's all. They were a dollar. I'm going to say about five or six of these could totally work. I think what I might do is break one in half. Oh, gosh, yeah, there we go. And do it in between the middles. And I know you guys may not see me doing it really close to the bottom, but I promise you that's what I'm doing. Okay, let's see. I might do it in between. Let me get my scissors and see if I can cut this instead. Yeah, you totally could do that. Totally could do it. Oh, these cut with your scissors, you guys. I just want to make sure that it doesn't pull through the middle. Perfect. 
so okay and this should be all that we need to make sure that this is held together nice and nice and strong okay and you totally could get the brown paper they come on rolls and just cover the back up for sure but i am going to use these to hold it together okay these popsicle sticks are probably the best thing ever hi gloria it doesn't really harvetta that's crazy okay now coming back to finish the main part you guys we are almost done now what i want to do is i'm going to get my country plaid transfer and we are going to put it on here after we get the country plaid on we're going to add our little baskets and from there we will add our sweet little banner okay we'll hang it like this like this like this and it might be it might hang off a little bit and i'm not i'm so not worried or i might just have to layer over it no biggie and we'll put some grass in with some eggs and some of our cute little dollar tree carrots oh my god this is going to be adorable so let's get this finished up you guys so let's get the country plaid where is that transfer hold on give me one sec you guys one second i gotta grab it in the back room Down here with you, babe. Oh, yeah. Good. Are you done? Just now. Getting out the transfer, huh? Oh, yeah, I'm still alive. I have to pull out the transfer. I got. I'm two thirds of the way done. What should you do? You should hang out down here with me. Harriet, hello, watching from South Carolina. You have a bunch of those sticks, Stacy. They're pretty awesome, right? Okay. So I think what I'll do is I'll strategically put this on here where I know that I can hide the bottom. Hi. Uh, I'm not sure if he was able to Okay. Is it got, does it have my, mine in there too? Yeah. Yeah, you can put that in. Thanks. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and get this on. And I'm gonna do this in a nice neutral color, probably like the storm that comes inside, what's it, vacay? I believe storm comes in vacay. So let's do that color. Let me find it. Here it is. We'll do storm. Or we could do, I think, ocean mist. Wait a second. Hold on. One sec, please. I'm trying to work with colors that are in those two. Oh, how about we just do sage? Can't go wrong with sage. Let's do sage. Where is my sage? Here it is. Sage comes in the bloom. I believe, or is that eucalyptus? 
hold on. No, it is sage. Yay, we're going to use sage. Sage is like my color, you guys. And it's a great background color that'll that'll match my house any time of year. Oh, this is probably not going to open well. Oh, there it goes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's get this stirred up. Oy, oy, oy. We are so close to being done, you guys. I told, I like I said, I know you guys always say you like the longer lives, but I do, oh gosh, I do worry. This color, I'm just going to let you guys know, I did find this in my stash. It's probably about a year old. We're going to make it work because I don't have any other sage. This was like in my personal stash. It was never open and I found it inside a bag from when I was doing vintage market D's. That should tell you how old it was. I haven't done a vintage market day in well over a year. So that should tell you how old this paste is. But you know what? I'm going to make it work. For sure. It's getting stirred up. It's working. It's not as... Not as uh, good consistency as I want, but guess what, guys? For a way old paste, I'm going to take my chance with it. It's okay. We're going to make it work. And I'm going to use our new four-inch handle, our new handled squeegee with it. So let's say what happens with this. It's a little chunky, you guys. Oh, well, I just got it on my carrot. So let's see. Woo! I'm running out of room on my desktop. Here it goes. Okay. Oh, this is gonna work. This is gonna be seriously just fine. Wow, I like this handled squeegee so much better than the other one. <gasps> wow. And you know what, guys? I actually kind of hope this does distress a little. Because it'll give, oh, it'll make it look so good if it does. Watch, the one time I want it to distress, it'll probably go on perfectly. That will be my luck. Oops, of course I went off of it at the top. No biggie. Okay. Go a little more down here. Guys, look the quick work it makes of this. Wowza. That is what I'm talking about. Okay. Wow, there was a lot of excess up there. I did not see that. Okay. I'll scrape it back into my jar. I'll save it for later. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to peel it up. Gosh, it looks so good. Oh my goodness, you guys. It looks so good. Wow. Uh-oh, did I lose? Did I lose everybody? What happened? There it goes. I did sometimes get bleeding. How do I prevent that? Hi, Pam. Thanks for sprinkling, Pam. Now, what are you talking about that you bled on, Stacy? What bled? Um... You sometimes get bleeding on what? Tell me what you're doing where you sometimes will get bleeding. And I'll happily help you with that. Thanks for sprinkling, Pam. All right, so I'm going to quick dry this. And like I said, I didn't do all the way to the bottom because you guys, these things are going to cover it up. And whatever I have inside them. I'll have to see if I can adjust my camera or see how I can push this up a little bit. There it goes. I hope this sell the scraper as a refill tool. I don't understand what you mean by that, lady. 
My letters weren't crisp when using in the past. Did you, what, um, did you have it where it dried inside the silk screen? Because if that is a big way for that will ha where it'll happen is if you don't move quick enough. But with creamy, dreamy, oh, on a wood surface, it's because you need some paste wax. Um, Stacy, if you have not purchased our paste wax yet, you're going to want to get that because when you put the paste wax on the wood, it will go inside the wood grain where it will bleed. Um, trust me, I've done that countless times. Countless. Okay, now you guys, we're going to go ahead and add on the cute little wood um, boxes. I'm trying to hurry up and quick get them on so they don't dry on me. Hopefully I put it on straight. Oh, I think I did. Okay. I think we got that on pretty well. I do too, Pam. It's so awesome. You're so welcome. No problem. You speak from experience, Aileen. God, I love you. You're so cute. Um, oh, see, this, I did not, it dried too fast. Dang it. There we go. Hopefully it'll work this time. Yes, agreed, Kathy. Oh, yeah, I don't know, Heidi. I'm not sure. If the two cubbies were white and sage, you could use it. Every Caesar by chain mouth inserts. Oh, for sure. For sure. You totally could, Vicky. All right, now I'm going to just add, <gasps> whoa, sorry. I'm going to just glue alongside here so that way I know it's being held down because I currently at the moment am not trusting it. And I think I'm running out of glue, so I got to find more glue sticks. Oh, hold on. It's top heavy. Definitely needs to be filled. Please hold. Okay, hold on. Glue sticks. Here we go. Really? There we go. Okay, here we go. Here we go. All right. Now we're golden. <gasps> Yikes. Okay, that side is good. Let's get this side. You guys probably cannot even see what I'm doing, and for that, I apologize. Freak, that is hot glue. Just stuck my finger right in it. Hooey. Oh. Okay, now I trust that, there we go, Get over here. All right, so now that that is glued, now we're going to get, I'm going to close this up actually before I wind up getting it everywhere. That's number one. That is number one. some water into it okay so now that we have that done let's get some of our Easter grass ready I opened up this bag yesterday we'll do you know what we'll do this color this works this does not feel like the typical Easter grass you guys it just definitely does not. 
He is a little different. That is for sure. And look, see, it's covering up where I didn't do. All right, so we've got that part done. Feed it over there. Now we can add in our little eggs. Yes, Kathy, I can. Small ones, small classes I can do. Small, small classes. All right, so we've got that. Now I need to figure out how I'm going to hang this because it's not going to fit all three of them in there. But I think what I can do, hold on, I have to turn it sideways so I can reach it. I still have these guys to use. I think what I'm going to do is, maybe go like this. Have this one come in, have this one come in, and then have this one hang from the bottom. Like in the middle of them both. That could be super cute. What do we think about that? Do we like that? Let's get that out of the way. Take a drink. Not yet, Burn. I'm waiting until I get the surfaces in. Oh, yeah, Heidi. Awesome, Kathy. Oh, awesome, Cheryl. I, hey, I think it was the luck of the draw there for me, for sure. What do you guys think about this? Are we on board? Do we like it? I think I'm going to go with it. And I like the swag look. That's cute. That's that, this way, if you get the paper grass, it won't hurt them. Yep, Mary says cute. Okay. All right, well, then guess what? We're going to go with it. So what I think I'm going to do is, I think, and I could even maybe even put him closer to the top. Um, I was thinking I was going to hot glue it, but here's what I just realized. If I hot glue it, then I won't be able to reuse this. I could do magnets. Oh, do I have magnets with me though? Oh, do I have magnets with me? Let's see. Let us see. Um, I could do little magnets on them. I've got springs. I've got magnetic tape. I wonder if magnetic tape would work. Shall we see? It might be too heavy for magnet tape. Let's see. And if this holds, I'll hot glue this on the back. Ha, <laughs> you've already finished two chocolate martinis? That's awesome. I have not even finished my one drink yet. Let's see if this will work. If it does, I will quickly take it off and hot glue it on. Oh, it feels like it wants to work. <gasps> Let me see if it's going to work. I will hot glue it. Oh, yes, it worked. <gasps> okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to hot glue it on to the fabric because I don't trust that it's going to stay. And I'm going to hot glue it on the board, and then I can do pennant banners. Um... I don't, I don't, Vicky. No, I don't have that. All right, this. Well, guess what? This stuck pretty well. Okay, we'll go with it. And this, yeah, that stuck pretty good too. That's awesome. Okay, so let's get another piece. And we'll hot glue it on. Gosh darn it, that hot glue is super hot. Ugh. 
and scolding my skin. Okay. Let's get another piece. Hopefully equally as long and wide. Okay, and I'll put it like this. I think I'll put it like that. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. You guys. Oh, I love it. And it's going to hide my boo-boo where I accidentally went over. Oh, it's going to be precious. And now, and then we're going to finish stuffing the inside of the baskets at the bottom and we're done. You guys, tell me that was not an awesome ouch project. Nice long project that you guys like. You know who I have not seen on the last few days? Where's Maria St. Peven? Anybody know? Is she okay? Oh, yeah, for sure, Kathy. Hey, Cindy, how are you? I got it from, um, gosh, I think a, uh, like a Michael's or a Joann's or something. Hey, handsome. I'm just about done. All I have left to do is add my... Sure. What? Sure. Yeah, serious. <laughs> you don't believe me? <laughs> oh, you guys, it's so cute. Oh, I love it. Okay. Now I got to stand it up. We got to, oops, got to put in some of our little pieces. And once we fill the bottom up, it should stand on its own. So here, I'm going to lean that on there so it stays up. So we've got cute little purple bun buns. She was on staycation. I know. So where did she go? Let's see. Um, thanks, Mary. Okay. Let's get some of these little guys out. I don't know how many of them I'm going to use. And I'm probably going to have to cut some of them down them out of their bags. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. This turned out so freaking cute, you guys. Okay, so let's see. Oh yeah, we definitely need to uh, cut down a little here. Whoa! Did you see that go flying across the room? It's that wood stick right there. Whoopsie daisy. Whoopsie daisy, baby. I don't need it. Oh, it landed on my plate, I think. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh no, the bun bun came off. What do you still have to do? I'm just sticking in the pieces in here and we're all done. How many? Banana. Just a few. Like that. Oh, look how adorable. What do you think? It's Easterish. Easterish, all right. Oh, my goodness, you guys. It's so cute. All right, let's get, we'll do our big eggs. We'll make them be close to the bottom. I know it's a little hard for you guys. She said she's, well, she said she was crafting with, Okay. All right. Put that guy there. Rot row. I may have made it a little too top heavy. I may have to figure out a weighted base situation. You just got back from my favorite store cat. See what colors I didn't use. 
orange. And we'll do green. Okay, and then we got to do my little um, carrots. Got to figure out how I'm going to stick them in. I think maybe just along the back. Got to take the tag off, Jess. That would be helpful. Okay. Oh my gosh. I am obsessed with how stinking cute this turned out. Oh my goodness, you guys. Okay. I'm going to have to, hold on. Let me come up here to me so I don't make you all sick. I don't have to do it like this. Okay. Are you ready? Okay, so here's the top of it. Don't mind her paper stash. Here's my little bottom. I feel like I could put a little welcome sign right about there. So I may add that in, but not tonight. But look at my fun little swag. Oh, it turned out so cute. What do you guys think? Do you love it? What do you think? Tell me down below. All the items that I used tonight can be found in my cart link. Um, you can go ahead and grab them and um, hopefully make your own project. Uh, yeah, I totally could do that, Kristen. Rocks for sure. There you go, Kathy. Oh, I hope you guys love it. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Um, hi, Sue Dini. Um, thank you, Deb Burns. Everything, like I said, is in the cart link. I hope you guys enjoyed my project tonight. I'll be back tomorrow. Now, I might be a little late tomorrow night because Little Brand has a dentist appointment at 10 after 5 and... Lord knows our dentist likes to take his time. So hopefully I won't be late, but I might. Thank you, Lori, on your porch. I think I'm going to put it on my entryway table, Burn. Um, thank you, Patty. Thanks, Kristen. Thanks, Melissa. I appreciate it, you guys. I hope you have an awesome Sunday night. Stay warm. Stay safe. Um, I'll be back tomorrow with another project. Uh, and I guess we will just go from there. So uh, two more days, you guys. Two more days till the big final release. Can't wait. All right. Have a great night. Bye.